Hey Cancerians, welcome back to Star of the Universe Tarot. This is your what you need to know in the next 72 hours reading. Um, if this is your first time, welcome. Uh, please hit the like, share, and subscribe button if you haven't already. And please join me every other Friday for TGIF Free Question Fridays if you haven't already. Um, the next one will be held um, November 11, 2022 at 6.30 Pacific Standard Time. That is the 1111 portal if you guys are interested. Um, that will be in the description box below as well as the instructions for the 50 subscriber giveaways for the Sacral Chakra Oracle deck which we are still doing until December 1st when we are going to close the list. So if you guys are interested that uh, instructions are also in the description box below with my TikTok and my Instagram which I have a new segment on Instagram you guys. Um, called Stop Trying to Make It Make Sense, Healing from Abusive and Narcissistic Relationships. If you guys want to go ahead and check that out. We are three sessions in. The fourth session um, will be Friday, um, November 11th as well um, at 2.30 Pacific Standard Time over on Instagram Live. So you are invited to come um, and... Share your survivor stories if you need, you know, if need be, if you guys, or just tap in for the, for the session. All right. Let's see what we got going on, because we have a lot going on already. So, we have the Magician here, the Ace of Cups, the Star card, and the High Priestess. So, we have Manifest, oh, hold on, Creation, Manifestation. Orgasms in the reverse, connection, and law of attraction. You could be dealing with the Virgo, Gemini, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Aquarius, Pisces, Cancer. Um, so, uh, Earth energy over here with the Ace of Pentacles in the bottom of the deck, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. But Ace of Pentacles is usually Capricorn energy to me. So, listen, you are manifesting a brand new something for yourself it feels like a brand new life with the ace of pentacles and the ace of cups you want money you want a new relationship you're done dealing with psychopaths you're done dealing with narcissistic people you're done dealing with self-absorbed people with the start of the star card in the reverse it's like you're tired of dealing with people who only want to be in polygamous relationships cancer and you're just like over it you're like, you don't understand why somebody can't just be with one person and one person only. Clar um, clarify the magician manifestation. Yeah, the Ace of Pentacles here. Look, the Ace of Pentacles in the bottom of the deck. The Ace of Pentacles right here. You're manifesting money here. A, a lot of money. Let's see. With the Seven of Cups and the... and Oh, okay. With the Seven of Cups and the Ace of Cups here, with the um, creation card here, this has created a lot of confusion in your life. Um, mostly because I feel like your manifestation is here. With the Ace of Pentacles here, it's like all aces are gifts from the universe. It's like you have tangible proof, Cancer, that what you wanted has manifested and now you're scared. You're afraid. Clarify the star card in the reverse. It's like, be careful what you wish for because you just might get it. Yeah, with the justice card here. And it happens so quickly. Way quick, way quicker than you could have ever imagined here um, with the justice card here. But this is your karma. This is good karma for you. Maybe some of you guys have could have manifested a ton of options for this brand new beginning. Um with the ace of pentacles and the seven of cups and maybe you're more afraid of making the wrong decision but with the justice card here right after the seven of cups something is telling me that as long as you stay in your truth no matter what decision that you make it will be fruitful because you have the ace of pentacles at the bottom of the deck so we ended with the, the ace of pentacles and we started with the ace of pentacles like this ace of pentacles is in your vibration in your vortex it's in alignment with you already you just need to let go of some type of fear here clarify connection the nine of pentacles some of you guys are afraid that you're going to be single for the rest of your life. 
and I think that there is actually a, a potential for a very um, steady marriage partner here with the justice card here because when the nine of pentacles came out it it dropped like this so that's like crossing energy right you're not sure you want to like you don't want to be rich and lonely is what it is cancer it's like you don't care if you have all the money in the world if you have nobody to share it with which is very cancerian energy you know like uh, cancers we just want to uh i don't ha actually we ha i actually don't have a bit of cancer in my chart but my grandma was a cancer so i know like i channeled through her a lot but it's kind of funny because cancers all they want to do is they want to be the homebody they want to take care and nurture and that and it's um very much dictated by the moon right cancer energy that mother energy so you want to be in your highest vibrational archetype for that but I think you're kind of fighting yourself. There may be some type of fear between um, coming into a solid relationship or even becoming a mother here that may be keeping you from accepting some of these options here. But um, yeah, with the Six of Cups here, if you don't have children already, that could be definitely an issue for you. Yeah, with the Queen of Swords here, it's like you're almost like not completely against it, but there, that is something that um, is a sacrifice for you with self-love here. It's like, do I want to put my body through that? And it's like some very serious decisions that you have to make, Cancer. Um, I feel like some of you have to, if you have children already, you're definitely not looking in the arena to make more. Um, so that could be an issue when deciphering where uh, you want to move next as far as a partnership as well. Um, some of you are afraid that if you uh, meet somebody and they don't have children already or if you're dating someone who doesn't have children already um, they either a won't be accepting of your ch children or b they they are going to ask you for a child of their own at some point and you're very much afraid of giving that no for an answer clarify the law of attraction here yeah, we got double nines here. Yeah, so you feel like, well, so so here's the thing, though. With the nine of pentacles and the nine of cups, it's like your wish fulfillment is there. Your manifestation is there. What's key, the only thing that's keeping you in this heartbroken stance with the three of swords here is the what ifs. Yeah, with the chariot card here, you're ready to go. Your higher self is already at the end of the line here with whatever person that you're wishing for this to happen with cancer it's just you need to get out of your own head and stop breaking your own heart here with the three of swords um thinking of the if ands or maybe before it even gets there it's either you're living too much in the past or you're living too much in the future and you're not allowing this potential marriage to grow into the successful um into the successful marriage that it's supposed to or a successful partnership it th this is definitely um you just trying to find alignment with yourself cancer because everything that you want the money the relationship the wish fulfillment it's all there you just need to look up look from the nine from the seven of cups to the nine of cups like you just need to look at your cups from a different perspective because I feel like you feel like you've been cheated somehow with the seven of cups but it's not that you're just not looking at all nine cups at the same time so you definitely need to change your perspective here and you'll see that your confidence will definitely align you to the law of attraction here because with the three of swords um, and the nine of cups on top of the law of attraction it's kind of like you're like I said, this one's definitely in the background for you. If you're feeling this Three of Swords energy, if you're feeling that sadness and lack, that's what you're going to attract more of until you see yourself as abundant. Look, perfect. We'll take this with the abundance of sol solstice here. And then the Nine of Pentacles energy again with the Flower of Life under the deck. Yeah. Be confident in yourself, Cancer, because you are a master manifester you came out you have the magician and the high priestess here you are um 
in perfect balance with your masculine and feminine energy to attract whatever it it is that you want in abundance here love money success luck really it's all there for you with the justice card here nine of cups yes it's meant for you karma free but you have to actually accept these blessings open yourself to receive okay and it's funny because i feel like the abundance of sothis is like a ace of pentacles energy too because it's the very first card in this deck and it's about abundance and it's almost like you got the ace of pentacles three times and if you're looking at the sothis here it looks like the ace of pentacles right here so really neat just to throw that out there it's understand that if you feel abundant you are abundant thoughts turn into things that's the biggest law of attraction um i feel like lesson you're learning right now and you just need to have patience for yourself cancer i really truly love yourself stellar blessings of the celestial goddess of abundance abundance in many forms is flowing to you now beloved intend right now to receive it just decide to do so in your heart in this very moment the oracle of abundance of solstice comes as guidance to expect increased flow and to continue your good works of building channels through which abundance can be delivered to you freely share your talents love wisdom and self and enjoy the abundance responsibly flowing to you in many forms over and over again you the the universe is trying to bless you cancer just be open to receive all right that's what i have for you and i hope this helps bye